9 a.m. December 12th. <laughs> what? No, December 10th. Yet yeah, this morning, I'm going to go grocery shopping with my friend Jason and then just study for the day. Got a pretty good night's sleep. And I forgot to change my tallies yesterday. It is now 97. It's day three and do two check marks. Slowly but surely we're making progress. Just wanna get this first final done. Guys, what's the difference between eggnog classic and eggnog original? These. Thought it was gonna be a small shop. $163, my goodness. Well, $25 is for my friend Oliver, but still. All right, pretty hearty haul today. I do not want to study at all. I just want to go back to bed. Back at the basement, it's 11 o'clock. I feel so rough. Um, so I might have to supplement myself. I've been procrastinating so much and I, like I can tell when I don't want to do something because I'm going on my phone like way more often than usual. I just don't want to study for this class. Ain't no one gonna get the work done but me, so let's do it. Finally have vegetables again after a couple days without them and a study break. 5.08 now, just got back to my place. Decided to cut it short just a little bit sooner so I can get my workout done sooner so that I can get some more studying done before it's super late. But yeah, I definitely feel a bit more comfortable for the exam in two days. And I know I was feeling terrible, but I sat down, had like half a can of yerba mate, and I, that was like, I don't know, like I said, uh, what's the right word? It was like a, like a, I, I can't think of it. It was just like, it got me right into the zone and I felt way better and I got a ton of stuff done. So that is good. Probably, I'll probably uh, take a few more of those over the coming days seeing how well it worked. Yeah, but now it's time for the gym. I'm just gonna do a chest day, uh, Pretty keep it pretty simple. Um, and yeah, there's not much else to it. I probably won't get the best mark in this class. I mean, half of the exam is open book and I feel like you could study forever for that. So at one point I'm just gonna cut it off and you know, just accept my fate, but I'm totally fine because as long as I pass this class and I don't have to do it again, I will be ecstatic. All right, here I am for the quick voiceover. So today it was just a straightforward chest day. Started off with five minutes on the rower, did my warm up, and then I did one set of flat bench with the dumbbells. But like I said last video, the 45s are way too easy now. So I did this for one set just to get things primed up. And because um, I've actually been working out a lot more, I'm going through my push-pull leg split really fast, so um, I thought it was time to switch it up today. So I did some incline with the barbell, and the first set that you guys are seeing here, I put my grip too narrow, um, and it was really hard, so I only got like six reps. And so after that, I uh, switched it up, and I did a little bit of a wider grip, but at the same time, I made the grip wider. I also lowered the weight, so this set was like super easy. I think I repped out like 15. Um, but yeah, the gym was like super quiet today. It was good to get like a variety. I feel like I've been doing the same exercises in a row for like a couple of weeks now. So I was like to spice things up. Now, one thing that I've been too lazy to do, and I guess this is like a trend when it comes to working out, is that I don't record the weights in the sets that I do, just like I don't keep track of the calories, which I feel like is a really bad habit. I should be keeping track so that every time I go to the gym and I do like a different exercise like I did today, I'll be able to determine right away what weight I should be starting at and what weight I should be having for my max set. Anyways, after that, I just did my usual um, dumbbell lateral raises. Started off with 20. But today the weight was feeling like super heavy. I think it's because I didn't eat enough. I didn't have a big lunch because I didn't prepare it. So um, it wasn't the best a couple sets, but I still got a crazy pump. But after I do this and I walk to the other gym, my shoulders always hurt so bad. So once I got to the other gym, I just did the usual chest uh, machine. Did that for like two or three sets. I was pretty smooth and then I did some cable flies, some variations of that. 
didn't record any of that and then I just finished off with some tricep extensions um, yeah the gym was pretty busy so I couldn't get a shot of that but oh well so yeah that was the workout today back from the gym showered and now making dinner as fast as possible I'm making some chicken breasts and I bought some I bought some teriyaki sauce today and I was like sweet can't wait to make that until I realized I just picked it up today I was like why is it so liquidy I bought marinades of sauce so um don't know how this is gonna go all right quick and easy dinner rice chicken it actually turned out all right with the marinade smoothie it's 8 30 time to lock in another study session probably only 90 minutes so like just past 10 p.m but yeah this welcome to the grind 10 30 now i uh, did some procrastinating to get some work done i've realized that if all i do is just like think about it being over that makes studying like that much harder so today I've just been focusing more on like being in the in the present and like not having any emotions about that like okay right now I don't have to do some work yes then then just like get to it don't like keep thinking like oh man I can't wait till this is over because I think it just drags on and it felt much better today so you know even though it's 15 days or like 14 days now just like one day at a time, just be completely present. And then when it's over, it's over.